are talking Avengers Infinity War. This is going to be a pretty much a non-spoiler review, although I've kind of waited a few days after this movie was released, so I can kind of, just in case I slip up, uh, obviously this is the culmination of 10 years of the MCU, and, um, you know, what do we think? I'm not really going to talk about too much of the plot, suffice to say, it's about Thanos, the big bad, coming to Earth, wanting to get those Infinity Stones, and uh, obviously it's up to all the heroes from the MCU to try and kind of take him out. I like this movie quite a lot. I definitely say it's probably one of my top five MCU films. I think it's the best Avengers film. I was too and fro whether I like the original Avengers or this one better, but I've got to say, thinking about it, I feel there's boring elements in the uh, the, uh, the original Avengers. That first scene, uh, the, the scene on the heli carrier where Iron Man's fixed the jet for ages. There's boring scenes in that film, which I don't think there is so much in this film. I will say that this film is not really for kids. My brother took my seven-year-old nephew to see it and he was scared um, halfway through and had to be taken out. So if you have young kids, this isn't your kind of your McDonald's Happy Meal movie. It's definitely the, uh, the darkest of the MC movies to date, but it definitely has the best villain, the most the drawn out. He has actual motivations that you can kind of understand. And although he's not particularly, um, maybe not relatable, but you kind of do understand where he's coming from. And uh, my camera is misting up as I've left it in the front room and it's got cold here. So apologies about this misty, weird thing that's happening in front of it. Um, is there any other negatives I have quickly? Some of the CGI is a little ropey, especially towards the end in the Battle of Wakanda that you would have seen in the trailers. There's clearly reshoots that have been done that I don't feel have had, had as much love and care on it. Uh, some of the characters do get a little bit shortchanged, and ultimately, yeah, there probably isn't lots of, tw you know, well, there's not so, there's not a lot of plot in this film. It's just a series of assaults, um, but you know, and then kind of just mini confrontations within that story. But there's not, there's not a whole lot of story to be, to be quite honest. But it, what we do have. is a joy to behold the fantastic character interactions that we have different pairings that we've not seen before and uh, yeah and I kind of really like this movie quite a lot um, I'll make this this review pretty short to be honest because this is about the 10 millionth uh, review of this film that we've got on the internet and my camera is steaming up like a beauty uh, so I'll give this movie an 8 out of 10 I think it's the best Avengers film I don't think it's the best MCU film however um, that is still the Winter Soldier if you ask me anyway what did you think of it leave me a comment and I'll look forward to seeing you next time bye for now